Tentacles, 1977, directed by Ovidio G. Asinitis, starring John Huston, Shelley Winters, and Bo Hopkins. Jaws with an Octopus. Jaws with an Octopus. Jaws with an Octopus? Jaws with an Octopus. This film was recommended by a fan. Thanks for the suggestion. A word of caution. This film is not about Tentacles, the aquatic warrior god. If you watch this film expecting that, you'll be severely disappointed. As I mentioned in my review for Dawn of the Mummy, Italian filmmakers developed a knack for capitalizing on American films by pumping out their own knockoffs. This film clearly had Jaws in mind. Unfortunately, this film lacks the memorable characters, gripping story, masterful editing, iconic score, basically anything else that makes Jaws an instant classic. Water, deaths, and marine life, that's all this film has in common with it. Jaws also understood how to work within the constraints of what it was actually able to show. The size of the creature seems to change drastically from scene to scene, which makes gauging the size of the creature nearly impossible. The filmmakers understood that Jaws' iconic theme was a big part of what made that film work. Unfortunately, they used an awkward harpsichord riff that almost makes the octopus sound like a skeezy pervert instead. This film doesn't really have a single protagonist that the viewer follows. This makes the final 20 minutes of the film, which follows two entirely different characters, feel tacked on and disjointed. The biggest problem with this film? It's painfully dull, unfortunately. You aren't even rewarded with any memorable kills for sticking around. I normally try to find one redeeming quality when I watch a film. Just one thing. I'm drawing blanks with this one. This wasn't the last time Asinitis worked on a Jaws knockoff either. A couple of years later, he produced the legendarily bad Piranha 2, a directorial debut for James Cameron. Verdict? Thumbs down. In a world full of Jaws knockoffs, this film should sleep with the fishes. That concludes this week's review. If there's any obscure sci-fi horror film you'd like to suggest, feel free to leave a comment below. Make sure to tune in next time for another thrilling, low-budget adventure.